Okay, what we're going to do in this problem is solve a system of linear equations by graphing. So we've got two equations here, y equals negative x and y equals 2x minus 3. So let's start with y equals negative x. We can see that this is already in slope-intercept form because we can rewrite it as y equals negative 1x plus 0, right? And from that we can clearly see that the y-intercept is 0 and the slope equals negative 1 over 1 or you can also write it as 1 over negative 1. So let's go ahead and graph that. The y-intercept is 0 and what I mean by that is the x coordinate is automatically going to be 0 because by definition the y-intercept is where the line crosses the y-axis, so the x-coordinate would have to be 0. So this right here. And now let's uh, start off with this slope, right? Negative 1. These are actually, this is actually the same slope, it's just two different ways of writing it, and you'll kind of see in a second. So let's start off with that, negative 1 over 1. So what that means is rise over 1. For every 1 we go down, we go right 1 point. So let's go down 1, right 1. Down 1, right 1. Down 1, right 1. We can also go the other way, and that's going to be taking advantage of writing it this way, right? Same slope, it's just going the other way. So up 1, left 1. Let's go ahead and do that. From 0, 0, up 1, left 1 up one, left one. You can just see we're going the other way now, right? So let's go ahead and draw that line. Uh, it's not that good there. Let me redraw that. There we go. It's a little better. Okay, let's go to the second equation. I'll use a different color here. I'll use green. So y equals 2x minus 3. So again, already in slope-intercept form, we can see the y-intercept equals negative 3. And we can see the slope equals 2 over 1, or we can write it as negative 2 over negative 1. So again, the y-intercept, since it's where the line crosses the y y-axis, we know this is going to be 0, negative 3. So let's draw that. 0, down 3. 1, 2, 3. It's right there. So let's start with the slope written as 2 over 1. So that's up 2, rise over, run up 2, right 1. So up 2, 1, 2, right 1. Oh, and you can see there we already uh, collide with the point on the other line. And that's actually going to be the answer, but we'll keep going. So up to right one, up to right one. Let's go the other way. I haven't written the slope this way, so that's going to be down to left one. So back to the uh, y-intercept, zero negative three, down to one two left one, down to one two left one. Let's go ahead and draw that line out. Ah, I'm not good at drawing these lines. Let me redraw that. Okay, it's a little bit better. Okay, so you can see from there where the two lines intersect. It's only going to be one point. That's going to be your answer, and that's right here. And that point, if we read out the uh, graph, it is actually right one, down one. So it's going to be one negative one. And that is your answer.